So have you ever wanted to make extra money on the side? Maybe you tried delivery apps like DoorDash or Postmates, the taxi apps like Uber or Lyft, but how would you feel if you were a delivery driver for, I don't know, UPS or Amazon? What if I told you you could deliver packages in your own personal vehicle? and make money. Hi everyone, if you don't know who I am, my name is Chris and I'm an Amazon delivery driver. Today we'll be exploring what it's like to be an Amazon flex driver, aka delivering Amazon packages in your own personal vehicle. Now you don't have to be an Amazon driver like me to do this. All you gotta do is download and sign up on the app, the Amazon flex app, fill out some personal information about yourself, your car, the location, and boom, you're ready to be a third party contractor for Amazon. So when you first sign up on the Flex app, you might be put on the wait list. I would know because I was there for several months. But eventually during December peak season, when the world needed him most, I finally got in. <laughs> Let me show you what it's like to be an Amazon Flex driver. So I want to show you what the Flex app looks like. It's pretty much the app I use at work, but with a little different variations. So this is the updates page. It's pretty much um, just tells you it's like a news feed for Amazon. Uh, we got dog safety. We got safety suggestions. And here's the sidebar. Very similar with a few variations. So if we go to the schedule page right here, this is the page that looks kind of different. So today we have our flex route. It starts in the hour 1145 and it's at 245. So that's a three hour block. It's a three hour block that pays $64.50. What that means is Amazon thinks you're gonna finish around three hours and they're gonna pay you that much for today's delivery. If you finish faster than the three hours, they'll still pay you $64. And if it takes you longer, they're still gonna pay you $64. This is a block I already secured. To secure blocks, you press upcoming offers and you're supposed to find the block. So right now there are no blocks. This is a page you're gonna see like all the time. And depending where you live, sometimes it's really hard to get a block. But I find that if you keep refreshing the page, eventually a block will pop up. Here's a screen recording on, I believe it was Father's Day, where you could find multiple blocks. It's usually not that many. Maybe, I think at any given time, it's probably maybe like three or four blocks that you can choose from because people are accepting them really quick. It's very competitive here in my area. But we have a block in two hours, so let's get ready for it. Winnie, you want to do a flex route with me? And of course my vehicle of choice, my Honda Civic. And since we gotta put packages in the car, Make sure your car is at least 85 to 90% clean. Unlike my car. All right, this is good enough. Driver and passenger seat, check. Back seats, check. Now we're in the car, ready to do the flex. When it starts to get close to your start time, this little orange button will pop up, go to start location. And our window to arrive is between 11.30 and 11.50. So let's start. Oh, almost got hit, just kidding. Gosh, Amazon. We're gonna be there in like 20 minutes. And I'll see you guys there. I think in one of my earlier vlogs, I used to deliver here. I think I have some footage. There's the car wash, there's the gas station. It had to be one of the first few months I started working at Amazon. 10, 10 minutes early. We probably got to wait a little bit. 
So the app says go right, but I know it's this way. You would think Amazon has their app right, would bring you to the right place, especially at an Amazon building, but nope, not here. There are no Amazon delivery trucks here. It's just all flex drivers. Let's park. I wanna park in the corner. And we're just gonna wait for like five minutes, 10 minutes actually. Since this is a same day shipping building, the area that they deliver in is much bigger. And if I'm going west, that's an hour away from home. And with Amazon Flex, you never know where you're gonna deliver. But we're gonna find out in four minutes. You only know once you get here. All the flex drivers so we gotta check our identity and then we have to verify our license So here's our staging number 174 and you can see on the floor right here We're rolling up. then you gotta scan a package say stop Oh, you like it? Yeah, it's like a body cam and small too. Yeah, I've seen those before, yeah. It's super cool. Nice. And that's 24-7? I mean, every time you're working? No, it's like uh, like 44 minutes. Don't let them catch you, though. Uh, <laughs> there was a guy posting on Instagram. Hey, go, I'm here. This, these people haven't given me. He got banned completely. Really? Oh, no. Later, man. Thank you. Hope, oh, guys, it's too late for that. Well, I'm banned from UPS, so let's make it two for two. Anyways, this is all our packages today. All right, here's our summary. We got 37 stops and we got 39 packages. Looks like we're delivering in three to four towns. The best way is to put it in order. In the other buildings, usually the driver aid number will tell you what number package it is in order. But in the flex routes, they don't. I like to organize my packages by town. So that's what we're going to do. Let me tell you how I organize my packages. First town right here. Second town directly behind me. Third town in the back. Any big packages all the way in the back in the trunk. I call that my overflow space. And the fourth town is also in the trunk. So once I finish the first town, all the second town packages come to the front. First stop is not too far, seven minutes away. Yeah, so the GPS is just like the app I use at work. And we gotta make a right here. So I'll be real with you. I've delivered on the street before. At my main job. It's throwback, flashbacks. Oh, park right here. All I gotta do press, I parked. And here we are. So it's a medium box. Do I have any medium boxes here? I got one. Must be in the back. It's not here. It's definitely not a medium box. 
Oh no. There it is. What are the package handlers doing? This is an envelope. My job, scanned package. I've definitely delivered to this house before. I'll put it right here. Less stops, but you're gonna be driving more. I guess it's something that I can live with. All right, let's go. Start travel. And then we're out of here. Everyone had to stop at a random bagel store. Today's Sunday. I slept in because I worked yesterday. And I woke up around like 10, 10-ish. Oh. A cool thing about flex routes is you can take as long as you want. But I think most people want to finish sooner than later because they're just trying to get that money. Apple juice. For those who are wondering. <laughs> You want to hear a funny story? So one of the first times I was doing flex, I was doing it obviously in my Honda Civic. So as I was walking back to my car, a guy was like, yo, you must be one of the fastest delivery drivers around here. <laughs> he thought my car was the, the fast version. So there's the Honda Civic, the regular one, and there's the Honda Civic Type R, which is the really fast one, <laughs> which I made my car look to be, but it's not actually a Type R. I told the guy, I was like, hey, how else do you think we do same day delivery? <laughs> I should have gotten a Type R. Now I can afford one, but back in the day, I'm like super, I was like super frugal, which I am still today. At least it's very economic. It'll get me far in life. It'll probably last me 200,000 plus miles and fuel efficient. We're at stop 27 out of 37, almost done. It's 217. Pretty bad time, honestly. Dalmatian! Right Have a good day. And yeah, if you guys like what I do in my videos, but you can't afford to quit your job, Amazon Flex is a very ideal place to be. Just to give it a try to, you know, feel it out. Because it's not as many packages, not as many stops and you get to explore your state and whichever state you live in. And make sure your phone's on a full battery too. I'm using the iPhone 12 Pro and usually when I do flex routes, I start from 100 and get down to like around like 50, 40%. This morning I forgot to charge my iPhone, so I have to keep plugging it in or else it'll die. We're at 21% right now. If you're new to delivering, Amazon made it real simple with the GPS. You just start travel, drive to a stop, deliver a package, and it'll automatically take you to the next stop. So if you're ever worried about not being able to do this job, it just takes a little fitness, a little driving skills, and you're good. My Honda's looking as nice as ever. Oh! Hello. Have a good day. Nice, right guys? The Honda. Yo. Our last stop is just around the corner. Condominiums, of course. Always with the condos. Uh, let's see, let's see. Nine. Okay. 
And boom, we are finished. Let's go. And it only took us three hours and 25 minutes. But you know, that's with me messing around, doing some filming, some vlogging. So at the end of the day, if you don't have any more packages, you can just go straight home from your last stop. And in this case, that's what we're gonna do. Now there are situations where you might have packages. For example, if there's a business close, if a package needs a password, if there's no safe place to drop it, you might have to return from the station you came from to return that package. But a good thing is you have 24 hours to return it. So if you're doing a flex route the next day, you can just drop the package then. So I made about $64 in three hours and 20 minutes. Is it worth it? Uh, I guess it depends on the individual. I did like six or seven flex routes before this. And what I found is you probably could finish an hour before the block time if, if there's no traffic. If there is traffic, I find that I, I finish on the time of the block. If you're an Amazon driver like me and you want to try flex, use a different email so you can sign up for flex. And if you're a flex driver and you like delivering and you want to become a big boy or girl Amazon driver, make sure you check out the channel. That's all I do over here. And I'll probably do more flex routes in the future. As a payment for me for working on my day off, make sure you guys like the video and subscribe to check out more Amazon delivery content in general. And with that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. See you later next time.